Hello everyone, this is Shudipto from Technical Potpourri. Today I'll be talking about two new methods from array grouping in JavaScript. They are called array group by and array group by to map. So without any further delay, let's jump in. So in today's video, I'll be discussing the new array group proposal, which is currently at stage three. This new proposal introduces two new methods from array and they are called array group by and array group by to map. They are very powerful methods and they will make your life very easy when you are dealing with array and you want to group the array uh, elements. So let's uh, go into some demo and see how this two method works. So what I'll do first, I'll create an array. Here is the array. What the array is doing, this is an array of countries and each element of the array is an object where the object is having two attributes, which, which is the name of the country and in which continent the country belongs to. So this is the name of the array countries. This array is having five elements, basically five object representing five different countries. Now let's say I want to group this array based on the continent what i can do i can use the group by method to uh, to uh, group the countries based on the continent so what i can do is that let's write the code let's say group by continent and what i am going to do i'm going to use this one and then this is the new method that i'm going to do group by what this method is to, will do, this method will take individual uh, element of the array, which is basically country. And then what it will return, it will return the country dot continent. Sorry, there is a spelling mistake. So this is exactly what it will do. Now let's uh, print the content of this group by one, the group by continent. So for that, I want to use a json.stringify, which will make the output look a much more readable format. And let's see. Now, as you can see in the right side of the console, uh, come on. As you can see here, let me clear the console and execute again. Yep. So what it is telling is that it's actually grouped this entire array, which is countries into continent. So in Amer, I have two country, Canada and United States. In Asia, I have one country, India. In Europe, I have two countries, Switzerland and Germany. So this is how you can use the group by method to uh, group the elements of an uh, array. So this array dot group by this array dot group by method is basically accepts a callback function, which is invoked with three arguments, the current array item, the index and the array itself. The callback should return a string that is treated as a group name where the items will be added. So basically this is how it will uh, behave. I'll just write something. So if you see this group by method, this group by method actually takes three arguments. One is that, you know, the current array item, which is the country. I don't need to put index here. And these two are optional, the index and array. And what it will do, it will return the key. So in, in, um, in my case, I am returning the continent as the key. And under the same continent, which country is there, it will group them all together. So this is how the uh, group by method works. Now let's go to the next method, which is a group by two method. So sometimes, you know, uh, you might want to utilize a map instead of a regular object, right? The advantage of map is that it can use any data type as key, whereas plain object can only be used, only use strings and method. So if that is your requirement, then you want to use array dot group by two method. This method works exactly the same way as like, you know, this group by method. The only difference is that it groups items into a map instead of a plain JavaScript object. So when you are using this group by method, it's actually move, it's actually group them in a, into a JavaScript object. Now, if I change this to group by to map, 
everything will be same uh everything will be same what is doing uh why oh, it's showing the error it should not show the error okay and then i will just put this uh group by continent map let's give a new name and then put print out this map so now if i execute i can you can see here instead of last time it was grouped by um, it, it it returns a, a javascript object but here it will return a map so that's the only difference so if, you, if your requirement is like you know i want to group by and return a map then use this group by two map method if your if your requirement is to just create a javascript object and group them all together then use the group by method so these are the two ways you can use this group by and group by two map method both are very helpful currently they are in the uh, in the uh, stage three um, of the proposal stage uh, but uh, yeah you can use that uh, you can use that it will make your code look much more readable and it will make your life much more easy in summary you should always use array dot group by two methods which will turn which will group the item into a map and you should use the group by method to group them into a simple javascript object i hope this video is helpful please hit hit the like icon and share and also please subscribe to my channel to get update about all my upcoming videos Till then, stay safe. Thank you.